Welcome to our podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we explore how alpaca mating may boost pregnancy via inflammation. The livelihood of some families is dependent on animals and birds, especially if we talk about the Andes Mountains, where alpaca rearing is one of the main economic activities of many households. Hence, the camelid mammals and their population become a vital part, making their different reproduction activity a matter of deeper analysis. Reproduction strategy is quite interesting in alpacas, as they are the only mammals known to science in which males deposit sperm directly into the uterus. This unusual reproductive method inflicts small internal injuries, but research has highlighted how the process may help improve pregnancy chances. A team of scientists has studied alpacas' intense intercourse, which can last for up to an hour. It is also said that the process does not seem to cause the animals any pain. Patricia Brennan at Mount Holyoke College in Massachusetts and her team studied the reproductive systems of 10 alpacas. A report published highlighted how the reproductive organ of male alpacas travels through the entire female reproductive tract during copulation and deposits semen at the uterine papillae of the oviduct entrance. The female alpacas that were the subject of the study were euthanized within 24 hours of mating. The scientists found bloody abrasions throughout the whole reproductive tract, suggesting that the male alpaca's organ had thrust its way through the vagina, past the cervix, and all the way into the horns of the uterus. However, the study said that mated females had much higher percentages of bloody pixels than receptive unmated females. As quoted by new scientist Greg Adams at the University of Saskatchewan in Canada, said that these findings confirm something alpaca researchers have long informally known. He also suggested the wound's purpose could be related to alpaca ovulation. According to Brennan, a little bit of inflammation in the uterus helps the fertilized egg successfully stick to the uterus walls. This process is similar to what is being done during IVF treatments in humans when doctors often scrape the uterine lining. Similarly, an alpaca pushing its way through the uterus may serve a similar purpose. Brennan said, We think that alpacas represent an extreme example of the good inflammation hypothesis. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.